Hello everyone, welcome to the session of Alphabet Technologies Private Limited. I am Srikanth working as a networking engineer in Alphabet Technologies. In this session, we will discuss about the basics of our AB switch of model AS200/10T. The topics will be covered in this lecture are how to connect the switch to the laptop and how to log in into the switch using console and telnet and using ssh and the basic configuration of the switch so how to connect the switch so this is our switch it have 8 1j ethernet ports and two and it have one cli and one reset button if you want to connect the switch to the pc by using ethernet cable now let's connect i'm connecting to the port 1 so by connecting this we can log in through telnet and ssh okay, let's open putty we are login using telnet enter default ip so if you face any login issues then then go to the control panel go to the network and internet change adapter settings in that i have connected using lan adapter that is ethernet 3 so go to the properties here sometimes automatically is there ip then we need to assign that is in in our ip range switch ip range i will use 20 and enter subnet click okay so let's open again the putty the default ip now we we are able to log in so our default username and password is admin admin password also now if you want to log in through console connect console cable to the cli port of the switch then open putty in pc select serial here it is asking com port to check that go to the device manager okay here it's showing ports here it is showing com 8 so let's enter it enter to laptop let's see the basic configuration of the switch so let's do the configuration now we are going to do how to change the switch name vlan creation and assigning ip address to the vlan port interface and how to enable the access mode and trunk mode for that first we need to enable the switch the command is enable enter so this is the privilege mode if you want to config we need to enter into con configuration mode this is the configuration mode now we need to change the switch name for that host host name is the command so let's give ab switch first let's do the vlan creation for that command is vlan let's create vlan 10 by default there is one vlan that is vlan 1 and ip address is 192.168.0.1 if you want to 
Sí. By using this command, we can see the current configuration of the switch. The switch. Here, it is the default VLAN 1 and the default IP address of the VLAN 192.168.0.1. So, let's create a VLAN. VLAN 10. Exit. To assign an IP address to the VLAN, now VLAN 10 is created. We want to assign an IP address to the VLAN 10. For that, interface VLAN 10. Here we can assign the IP address 172. And we also need to enter the Submit enter if we want to give a name to the villain for the command is description so this is the name then enter exit let's go to the port interface in port interface, we can give trunk port and access mode. Let's go to the port interface. Let us give a name. If we want to give access port, other follow the commands. If it is the port VLAN ID, that is written. If we want to connect switch to the laptop, then we need we need to use access mode. If we want to allow more VLANs in a port, then we need to enable the trunk mode in the port. So let us go to the port interface. First, we need to enable the trunk mode, switch port mode trunk, <coughs> and then switch port trunk. We need to allow more VLANs, so let's so we can allow 1 and 10 at the same time. Exit. So, for save all the configuration we have done, command is write all. Now let's check how to log in with SSH. For that, first we need to enable SSH. For that, the command is IP SSHD enable. Enter. Now save the command. Right on. So we have enabled the SSH. Let's log in. Session. Select SSH, enter our default IP, enter, accept. We know that default username is admin, enter, password is also admin, enter. So, this is about how to log in with SSH. Let us check the current configuration. So here, in the port number 2, we did access and alert port VLAN and here, port number 4, we have done trunk mode and allowed 1 and 10 VLANs. And this is the VLAN creation, interface VLAN 10, description we have given a bit test, I get this. It's all about this lecture. Thank you, thank you for watching.